and low IT. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are. You might be a person who's just getting done with your academics or someone who has got some experience in IT or non-IT fields. If you're thinking how you can get started into IT, cybersecurity, cloud operations, network operations, or uh, maybe Linux server engineering, anything, any, any particular domain in IT, well, it's very much possible. IT is definitely for anyone. But are you ready to put in some hours of learning? If the answer is yes, well, you're in the right place. I'd like to introduce some resources which will help you get your dream IT job and which will help you until you know what is best for you. So let us go ahead and get started. I'd like to name two learning platforms, one NetAcad, which is Network Academy, and another NDG, Net Dev Group. Well, these learning platforms provide free courses for anyone. You don't need a business email address. You can enroll for these courses using your very own personal email address. Now, this screen which you see over here is a recommendation from VMware on how to get started in IT. Well, first of all, you need to be aware of the basic IT uh, structure. For understanding that, you need to start from basic IT concepts like what all are the hardware peripherals and you know binary. So these are things which are taught in computer science graduation, or I would say even in schools. But even if you don't have a graduation in computer science, that's not a problem. That's not a requirement to get started in IT. You can learn these skills uh, from the comfort of your home or office. My personal suggestion would be to access these courses on a laptop or a desktop in case you have one. But again, in case you don't have one, these courses are easily accessible over a mobile platform as well. So if you're considering this very same learning path which I have opened here, you will start with basic IT uh, fundamentals, then you move over to cloud and virtualization, uh, storage concepts, and then networking. Well, this is just one recommendation from VMware. In case you are a person who has got some insight into IT, you have been doing uh, one particular stream of IT, and you would like to concentrate on something uh, specific. Well, here are the courses you might want to look into. You have ethical hacking, you have forensics, you have cyber ops, you have cloud security. You just name it. Almost everything is in here. You have uh, uh, Red Hat courses, you have uh, uh, software defined networking. So th there are a lot of opportunities on this platform. My personal suggestion is to uh, enroll these courses using a laptop or a desktop so that you'll see the entire view of uh, the interface. Not only that, once you complete certain courses in here, maybe something like virtualization or uh, software defined uh, storage concepts or cloud virtualization concepts, you will get globally recognized digital badgings as well. You will also get certificates which you can attach to your resume or maybe your LinkedIn profiles. So go ahead enroll for these courses. Once you enroll the, maybe for instance, here I have enrolled for Linux Essentials. Start with the learning module. Once you complete the entire module, uh, there are certain courses which give you access to uh, exam vouchers. Not saying they are 100% discount. There might be some discount, maybe 50, 60, or 80% of discount for courses which align to particular exams. But again, 
even if there are no online exams there might be course assessments at the end of each modules once you complete the modules take your course assessments clear them you will get course certificate and it's possible that many of these courses come with digital badging as well so go ahead enroll yourself uh, learn new skills and become hireable get your first dream it job and that's it so until we see next have a great day and a great year ahead bye for now